Alright, what is up YouTube? We are back after a long three weeks, I think, since I put out the last video with the whole quarantine and everything going on. It's been pretty crazy, but I've still been training. My gym actually let me borrow some equipment, so I got that down in the garage. So for the past three weeks, I've been training really light, um, just kind of like deloading the past three weeks. But last week, I started my first block of like my second college nationals prep. So still a TBD date. I'm thinking like end of June, later summer is what I'm really hoping for. So I never ended up doing my uh, mock meet that had happened or anything like that. So we are still building building the total, still in the process of building the total. So today, or this week I guess, I'm going to take you through kind of like how I've been training, what I've been doing. Since the beginning of the program, it is a little lighter. I definitely, I have like 500 pounds worth of uh, plates and including the barbell and stuff. So um, until later in the program, it shouldn't be an issue. But when it comes to deadlift, it gets a little close. So what we are going to do now is just whip up some pre-workout. So per usual, you're using the Ghost pre-workout. This flavor is blue raspberry. Alright, pre-workout's all mixed up. Let's head to the gym. Alright, so this is the setup we are currently working with. I will say my garage is not the cleanest. My dad and my brother have a lot of tools in here for work. But got the plates right here. We got 500 pounds worth of plates. I got a set of dumbbells right there and there's some 25 pound bumper plates. We got the mat. We got a little rack here for squat and bench. Deadlift on the mat and then we just got a bench here. So yeah. And I got my space heater over there because it gets freezing in here. Normally at the gym, what I do when I warm up is I ride the bike for 10 minutes, so that's what I'm, exactly what I'm going to do now. Try to keep staying in the routine, same type of things. It's a beautiful day out, so I'm going to ride the bike around the block a couple times just to get my legs warmed up because we've got squats today, and I'll be right back after that. Definitely a very confined space. Just hit my top triple at 440 pounds, and I'm pretty, I'm very happy with that actually, because I'm looking back at my last program here, and the second week of my last program, I did a single at 440. So I'm tripling it now, two week or the second week of my program, and yeah, I'm definitely pumped for 
continue with this program. So now I have a uh, five by five on tempo back squats. It's gonna be three second down eccentrically, a three second isometric hold at the bottom, and then one second concentrically up as fast as I can. I'm gonna do that for five sets of five. So finish the squat workout. Now I got dynamic deadlifts. Uh, this is 250 pounds. I'm gonna do nine sets of two with a very short break. So it's gonna be like one minute break in between each set, no more, no less. So I'm working on speed, staying tight throughout the movement. I don't have bands, but I loaded an extra 10 pounds on from what I'm supposed to do just cause I don't have bands yet cause no one's delivering and everything's sold out. So, all right, nine sets of two here. finished today's workout, Sunday workout, day one of the week. Squats, speed deadlifts, some accessory lower body. Yeah, gonna go get my post-workout in, um, celebrate Easter with my family. It is Easter Sunday. Hope everyone had a great Easter. And yeah, see you for tomorrow's workout. guys day two of the program it is Monday April 13th today is my bench day so for the program today we got a top triple at RP7 and we got a 5x5 five five, uh, tempo bench three down three pause one up at 75% which for me is 225 pounds then we got a 2x6 on close grip bench then some accessory shoulders and uh, some back stuff so we'll get right back into that. The weather in the gym today, or the weather in my gym today is freezing. So that's why I'm like all bundled up today. I just hit my top triple at 275 pounds for RP7. That felt super, super smooth. Very, very happy with that. Um, if I look back at my 
last program, I kind of compared the two programs. In the second week of my last program, I did 260 for a top single at RP7. So hitting 15 pounds above that for a triple, the same RPE, super smooth, super happy with that. I'm so excited with how this program is going so far. Now we're going to hit our back downs 5x5 five five tempo at 225 pounds. Just worked up to my top triple at 450 pounds conventional. Um, this is my first time, my first block doing conventional deadlifts, so it's definitely less than I was doing sumo. I think my last block, my second week, I did 475 for a single on sumo. So building up to conventional, it'll get there. Um, definitely getting stronger in my lower back, which is the point of me doing this. So now we got a five by five at 385 pounds with a two second pause. So we'll get right into that. weeks. is a creatine based supplement and I do one and a half scoops of ghost whey protein this is the coffee ice cream flavor got a prize with that one and then for carbs after my workouts I just have a banana and that's my post-workout uh, meal. <laughs> 